Good morning. I don't know about you, but I was super excited when I saw a little bit of sunshine on another rainy week. And I've been reading some, the psalm of our week, Psalm 104, that we'll hear in worship on Sunday morning. And I wanted to share um, a little bit from Psalm 104. So I'm going to read verses 1 through 4 and then pick up with verse 24 and also insert some, some questions for thoughts and meditations on this psalm. Bless the Lord, O my soul. O Lord my God, you are very great. You are clothed with honor and majesty, wrapped in light as with a garment. You stretch out the heavens like a tent. You set the beams of your chambers on the waters. You make the clouds your chariot. You ride on the wings of the wind. You make the winds your messengers, fire and flame your ministers. O Lord, how manifold are your works. In wisdom you have made them all. The earth is full of your creatures. Yonder is the sea, great and wide. Creeping things, innumerable are they. Living things, both small and great. There go the ships and Leviathan that you form to sport in it. These all look to you to give them their food in due season. When you give to them, they gather it up. When you open your hand, they are filled with good things. When you hide your face, they are dismayed. When you take away their breath, they die and return to their dust. When you send forth your spirit, they are created and you renew the face of the ground. May the glory of the Lord endure forever. May the Lord rejoice in his works, who looks at the earth and it trembles, who touches the mountains and they smoke. I will sing to the Lord as long as I live. I will sing praise to my God while I have being. May my meditation be pleasing to him, for I rejoice in the Lord. Bless the Lord, O my soul. Praise the Lord. Usually, I'll oftentimes tack on a song at the end of these meditations, but... The other day I was walking through uh, the Brunley Nature Preserve and I usually run or walk with headphones in and I took out my headphones and honestly I just kind of stopped and I was amazed at the sound all around me. And I had this psalm in the back of my head because I just read it that morning a couple days ago. So instead of a, a song sung by me or Aaron or anybody else, I decided to just record a few minutes of creation, blessing God, the birds singing, and the creeping things, great and small on the ground. The psalmist says, even if we fail to praise God, even the rocks will cry out. So let's enjoy uh, this gift of music, the manifold of God's works. <laughs> 